Hi, I'm Melanie McDowell, and I'm interested in the birth of membrane proteins. What is your research focus? So cells have lots of different types of membranes uh, with lots of different types of membrane proteins embedded in them and they are involved in important processes like signaling and transport. However, membrane proteins are initially born in the cytoplasm. So in our lab, we're interested in the question of how membrane proteins get from where they are made to the membrane in which they function. And we study two types of factors involved in this process. So the first types of factors recognise uh, postcodes within the membrane protein and deliver them to the correct membrane. And the second type of factors then inserts this membrane protein into the membrane. What methods do you use? Well, we are mostly interested in answering uh, biological questions and so we use the methods that are most appropriate to do this. However, we have a strong focus on structural techniques, so cryo-EM, NMR spectroscopy, and X-ray crystallography. And we also use biophysical methods to look at protein-protein interactions. In addition, we use biochemical assays to look at membrane proteins within the membrane environment. Why have you become a researcher? Well, since I was a child, I've always enjoyed uh, solving puzzles and arts and crafts. And so for me, research is the perfect combination of problem solving and creativity. And I really like that every day is different, whether it be doing experiments in the lab, analysing data, or communicating our results to other people. One more time. <laughs> the impress on cellular biophysics in three words. So I'll go for interdisciplinary, international, and inspirational. What would you tell your younger PhD me? Well, sometimes, or a lot of the time, experiments don't work, and this can really test your motivation. But I would say that perseverance and hard work almost always pays off, and that you should celebrate every success in the lab, no matter how small. What was your most exciting experiment? Well, I worked for six years during my postdoc on solving the structure of a small membrane protein complex involved in membrane protein insertion. And it took a lot of time to optimise the sample, and we finally managed to get uh, an initial visualisation of the structure using cryo-EM. However, at this stage, it looked uh, rather more like a potato. It was very low resolution. And over the coming months, uh, the structure did get a lot better. However, I would say my most exciting experiment was still this very first visualisation of my protein. That was the first impression of the McDowell Lab, and I look forward to seeing you on campus soon.